are major signs. Now, the minor signs, some of the scholars told us that all of them came to pass. We have witnessed all of the minor signs. Now, the concern of this presentation is about some of the 10 major signs of the approach of the hour. Five of those 10 seem to be cosmic in nature. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's your boy Jesse Keegan. And your girl Fanny Lungo. And we are Fanny and Jesse. So right about now, we're going to do another reaction. And before we get into the reaction, guys, we want to thank everybody for subscribing. And we want to get to 10,000 subscribers in two days. I know we're going to get there. And the most important thing too, we want to thank everybody who's been giving us reactions. You're the realest MVP. On to the reaction. Uh, not... Najla Azanai um, told us or maybe suggested that we should go react to the sun rising from the west. Yes. So uh, thank you so much for giving us this reaction. You're the realest and repeat Najla. And thank you, thank you so much once again. What, what do you expect from this video? I mean, I, I should learn how, why the sun is rising from the west. Probably, I should learn that. Maybe that's why. What do you expect other than your name? I mean, uh, probably it's going to talk about cosmology events or maybe some. Just like when they talk about the north, they say that's where the life began, probably. I don't know. Maybe that's where life started. I don't know. Anyway, let's find out. Without any further ado, guys, let's get it. Are they waiting for anything except the hour to come to them suddenly? But its signs have already come. Is Allah talking to us, brothers and sisters? Are you waiting for the hour to confront you? To hit you? To smack you in the face? People ask Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu to tell them when will the hour strike? When will it take place? And we all know the account when Jibreel Alayhi Salam visited the Muslims at the time of Prophet Muhammad وسلم, and he appeared as a human being dressed in very white clothes and he came and he sat to the halaqa of Prophet Muhammad وسلم, and started to ask him about Islam and Ihsan and Iman and then Prophet Muhammad وسلم, will answer him and after every answer Jibreel will say Sadaqta Ya Rasulullah Verily, you have told the truth. And then the companions were astonished. How could someone who is asking a question will say you have told the truth? How did he know that it was the truth? And then after that, Prophet Muhammad وسلم, explained to them after the debar departure of Jibreel that it was Jibreel who came to teach them the elements of their deen. And among the questions that Jibreel asked was the question about the hour. When will it be? And then Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam answered by saying That the one who is asked the question does not know any more than the one who asked the question. And indeed, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala told us in Al-Quran Al-Kareem يَسْأَلُونَكَ عَنِ السَّاعَةِ أَيَّانَ مُرْسَاهَا فِيمَا أَنْتَ مِنْ ذِكْرَاهَا إِلَىٰ رَبِّكَ مُنْتَهَاهَا إِنَّمَا أَنْتَ مُنْذِرُ مَنْ يَخْشَاهَا they ask you concerning the hour. What do you know about the knowledge of the hour? Verily, you only are a warner about the approach of the hour. No one knows. There were 16 ayat in Al-Quran Al-Kareem that mentioned the hour and asserted that no one knows when the hour will strike. Unlike many of the people around us who predicted that the hour will strike on such and such day. And one stands very clear in my mind. One of the televangelists went on television in 1994 and he said that the day of judgment will strike on March 22nd, 1996. I still remember that. March 22nd, 1996 came and it's gone and, and the hour did not strike because the knowledge is with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Now Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam told us that there are minor signs and there are major signs. Now the minor signs, some of the scholars told us that all of them came to pass. We have witnessed all of the minor signs. 
Now, the concern of this presentation is about some of the 10 major signs of the approach of the hour. Five of those 10 seem to be cosmic in nature, that they are related to certain happenings that are related to the cosmos, certain universal happenings that will take place that will tell us that the hour is approaching. And one of them is that the sun will appear from the west instead of the east. We have known that for years and years and years. And we were told that the sun will appear from the west as a sign that the hour is approaching. Now, again, I remind myself and I remind my sisters and brothers that whatever I will mention from science that people really put as, as, as the, the absolute truth when we know it is not, but what we know from science is the following. What is happening is that the Earth has been rotating around its axis since the creation of the universe. In the beginning, our Earth used to complete one complete circle around its axis in four hours. It used to be very fast. And it has been slowing down since then. Now, it completes one rotation around its axis in 23 hours, 56 minutes and 4 seconds. And scientists know that the speed is going to diminish. The Earth is going to slow down up to a point where it will not be able to support any more decrease in its speed. When that will happen, the Earth will behave like a spring that you rotate in a certain direction up to a certain point when you cannot really wind it any further in that direction. Then if you leave it, what will happen? It will start to rotate in the opposite direction. And the Earth is going to do that. That's what scientists tell us, that the Earth is going to slow and slow and slow up to a point where it cannot, because of its mass, slow any further. Then it will stop briefly and will start to rotate in a clockwise fashion. And guess what will happen when that takes place? The sun will appear from the west. And the hadith related through the authority of Hudayf ibn al-Yaman from Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam about this is very clear. When the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is reported to have said that when the hour approaches, two nights will join each other and the people will wake up from the first night to see that the night is not over yet. And they will be terrified and they will be scared and they will find that the sun did not come out and another night came and then two nights will appear in a row and then after that the sun will appear again but this time it will come from the west instead of the east when that sign is seen everybody will believe subhanallah even after the jal and isa comes down there are still gonna be people who don't believe they will believe. When they see the sun coming from the west, they will say, we believe, we believe. But when you believe? After you've seen reality, where were you before? When the sun comes out of the west, who are you going to resort to? The righteous believers and the pious believers who wake up for tahajjud and pray the night for prayers, one of them will wake up at that night and pray to Allah. And he prays his usual prayers. He reads his juzo, his half a juzo, his two juzo, his three juzo. And then he gets to sleep. Usually, he reads his juzo, gets to sleep, wakes up for fajr. But this time, he'll read his juzo, he'll read what he usually reads, gets to sleep, wakes up, he realizes the night is still long. So he prays to Allah again. And yet fajr has not even entered. And then he sleeps again. Wakes up, thinks that fajr is coming, about to enter. 
prays again to Allah Azza wa Jal, sleeps again, wakes up, he's still not Fajr. So he realizes something there. اِقْتَرَبَ لِلنَّاسِ حِسَابُهُمْ وَهُمْ فِي غَفْلَةٍ مُعْرِضُونَ اِقْتَرَبَ لِلنَّاسِ حِسَابُهُمْ وَهُمْ فِي غَفْلَةٍ مُعْرِضُونَ Jews need to mankind. Is there reckoning? Is there destruction? Yet they turn away in heedlessness. Yeah, he said so that. So would this be one of the major signs towards yeah. the end of the world? Yeah, he even said this is the major sign. I mean, the minor signs are the major, major part of. Yeah, part of the major sign. Just signs. one of them. Yeah. It's interesting. The minor signs, I, I think they have passed and probably they're still happening. Passed? No. No, they're still happening. The major, there are also major ones that are happening now. You know that. We're experiencing earthquakes all, all over the world. Earthquakes every 30 seconds or every one minute is an earthquake somewhere. I mean, this is going to be interesting. What do you mean interesting? Like when you wake Imagine up in the... Waking you, up and the sun is just not there. When, when you wake up and it's still night, it's going to be so, so bad. <laughs> people are, gonna, people are going to freak out. Everyone would freak out. People are gonna freak out. Like in two, you have two nights. You've never seen the sun. I mean, that's really, really bad. And the people who are How going to benefit. How is it going to affect people? It's, 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 it's the people with electricity. How I mean, is it going to affect people? It's gonna affect people. It's just like you know the way. Is, is that going to be confusion? Of course. Going to start fighting. I don't think people are gonna fight. I think people will start praying. That's the only way. The ones that pray will start praying. Yes. The ones who the ones were expecting to go The people who were expecting to go to work in the morning, maybe to do. For example, if you had a meeting with somebody tomorrow in the morning, maybe to have a deal or whatever, or so ever, then you wake up and it's still dark. Mm -hmm. It's going to create confusion. And you start calling. You understand? I mean, there's going to be a lot of confusion. A lot of confusion. The people who are going to understand that these are signs, I think they'll come down and, and probably pray. You understand? The people who, we, who the people who wouldn't really have that knowledge, probably there will they will be so much confusion and there'll be fights here and there or something like that. You get it. But this one but this doesn't mean that's the actual hour. It's just a sign. Yeah it's just a sign. This doesn't but mean the that end yeah. It doesn't mean like the end is Okay, it's a sign to show that the end is near, but it doesn't mean that that's the hour when the judgment day is going to come. But it's you know, never. even when this sign blankets F, some people will still be ignorant. Mm -hmm. Some will just be like, cool, I get to stay in. Yeah, I mean, but it's really... Have you ever had such a thing though? I've never heard about sunny rising from the west, but all I've heard is the, the calamities are going to happen just like the way the Bible talks about things. Like right now we're having the earthquakes, which is so true. We're having people are dying from diseases and whatnot, yeah. So uh, anyway guys, this has been a nice video and if you feel like you reacted to this video in a better way, give us a thumbs up and don't forget to go down in the comment section and tell us exactly what you feel about our reaction and what you feel about this video, the sun rising from the, from the west. Just let us know in the comment section below and we want to thank uh, people who have been leading us to do this reaction. We want to thank uh, Najla, you're the realest MVP, thank you so much. And the most important thing guys don't forget to subscribe to our channel the more you keep on subscribing the more you give us the motivation to do a lot of videos and to give you better better content last but not the least we're gonna see you in the next video peace out